Okay, we return after a good old time of delivering noodles and such, and now we're about to murder everything in the forest because why not? That was unintentional. Nice. Ooh, thinking about it. Thinking about it. I, I completely forgot about this. Uh, what was it? Uh, equipment skills. Heaven. S spells. Let's just replace fireball. With... Hmm. Nah, he should keep kin King Spin if anything. We never use Water Balloon, right? Okay, we never use we never use Flurry. I can tell you that for sure. Fire Pyre Pillar is an is awesome. We don't have another one. Yeah, we don't have another one. So I want to play Evan a bit. Now that we now that I have Pyre Pillar, I'm going to show you exactly how awesome it is. I don't know if we'll actually get the chance, but you know, we'll, we'll see. Honestly, Pyre Pillar probably would have been really good to use on that um, on that dragon, I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> now that I think about it, it's like, crud, we could have used that. Hmm. Oh dear, whatever am I to do? Don't worry, Miss Henny, I'm here. Literally, yeah. So yeah, that's fun. Oh my gosh, you are just so rebellious. Jeez. Oh, thank you ever so much. I thought you were done for. Golly, Evan, is that you? I've been so worried about you, dear. I didn't know what had become of you after the coup. But here you are, alive and well. Mm. It's lovely to see you again, Miss Henny. But what are you doing all the way out here? Hmm. Well, things in Ding Dong Dell have become rather uh, unpleasant of late. I thought I might set off somewhere else to do some teaching. And do some teaching. Whoops. It's all I ever wanted to do, you know. I don't care what tribe or kingdom my pupils come from. I just want to help them learn. Well then, you should come with me. I founded a whole new kingdom. You can be a teacher there. Oh, Evan, that sounds wonderful. I'd love to. But... Never mind then. <laughs> it's just like usually that's like when you say stuff like that, it's like there's always a but that's always in there, but but not but not the case, I guess. So there we go. Can I what can I do with pebbles? I actually don't know what I'd do with pebbles. Like how many how many pebbles do I have now I think about it? I can check that now. It's like it has to be in the hundreds now. <laughs> Is that not a thing here? Uh, 74, never mind, I only have 74. <laughs> 75. <laughs> well, what did I get? Serving of dice dumplings. Hmm, that's nice. So anyway, I saw that there was a fellow here that apparently has a quest marker. I wonder if I get to recruit him. Is this the... Is that how you doing with that, with that debt? After... After what you did to my, after what you did, what you did, my debt was forgiven. Thanks. And what's more, I have made myself a new pal. That's right, eh? Hey, we man. Wait. Oh, your debt. Oh, your debt was forgiven, and you just, <laughs> you just chose to have, <laughs> you just chose to keep him still. I mean. I mean, I guess, alright. I mean, some people like having pet snakes. I still don't get it sometimes. Anyway, so is that this guy? Hello. Hi. Oh, oh, hello there, Evan. I was th I was thinking about you and your kingdom. How's Muriel and Opaka's herder doing over there? I heard she's alright. Mm -hmm. uh, Muriel? Hi. Hi, dear old Muriel. I bet she's been causing all manner of mischief with, with her bows of hers, eh? 
I'm ever so sorry, but I don't think I've ever met anyone called Muriel. You don't know Muriel? Well, I never. I thought you would. She's a Grimalkin, just like you, you see. She had she had to flee Ding Dong Dell when all that unpleasantness happened. I, I was sure that she had made it to Evermore by now, but I know I know that's where she was heading. Cravens, I hope she didn't get lost on the way. What? That'd be terrible. I'll I, I better go and look for her right away. Oh, that's a that's ever so kind of you. Now I cannot tell you exactly where she might have gone. Have got to. Have got to. Okay. Have gone to. Yeah, I guess have gone to. But I guess got to. <clears throat> but I do know where, where she'll have her alpaca with her. And the two and the two of them and the two of them were young and easily distracted. Both. They've probably been charmed by the wonders of the forest somewhere along the way. Thank you. Thank you. I'll search the woods and see what I can find. Oh, she looks lovely. Sisters of No Mercy. Oh, well. Unless she seems she seems she seems lovely. All right, where's she at? Mario! <laughs> <laughs> wow. So somewhere out here, eh? <clears throat> All right, let's head to to the world map. There's another uh, invasion happening. I'm not right now. Season the seasons of war are currently, uh, you know, next season. <laughs> we'll do that after we level up our kingdom. After we level up our kingdom, and I do all the things that are, you know, for stuff like that, then I'll start doing that again. Sorry, I kind of got a little lost there. Okay. Oh, it looks like we're coming across a very familiar foe. Well, anyway, out of uh, pure anger, I'm going to go and uh, take this guy out. Because I've had it with him. I... No, I want to do it. Level 22. Weird. Here goes nothing. Now, that hurt. I hate most about slimes is that it's it feels just harder to predict. No matter what, it just seems harder to predict. No, fine. Alright, let's heal the lad. Dead. I go down, jeez. Ow. Gosh. I don't 
no, I can't function <laughs> as Batu in this in this battle. I'll tell you that much. Ah, jeez, why are you over there? <laughs> Sorry. Why are you doing this? Thing? Why is it suddenly so hard? <laughs> What it does? That was close. All right, get up. <clears throat> Ow, what the heck is this? I just want to tell you. I just want to tell you this, Lofty. But you suck. <laughs> you suck with how slow you are. Just heal. Or just send out more of those orbs more often. I swear. The last time I saw that was ages ago. <sighs> All right. Jeez, Batu is dead. This is a dead man walking. We don't. We barely have any revives left because you just. So stingy on those things, and it pisses me off. Ay. Eating these un unapologetically bitter treats can be quite a bracing experience. Boost the user's defense by one. Like, I forget if it was like always or like a little bit. I feel like that they're permanent, but I don't remember if they actually are. No, well, anyway. So you're somewhere over here. I don't know. Oh, hello. Is this that place with that higgledy head guy? Oh dear, where could he have gone? Oh. I think we found a missing person. You're Muriel, aren't you? Ooh. King Evan, gosh, I didn't expect you to meet you here. Are you lost as well? No, we came to look for you, actually. Would you like us to show you the way to Evermore? Oh, I'd love to go to Evermore with you, but I can't just leave yet. It's Paco, you see, my old Paco. He's gone missing. He ran off into the forest, and I just don't have the energy to go after him. Don't worry, Muriel. I'll go find your Ilpaka. Uh, you just wait here, all right? Thanks. Oh, thank you, King Evan. I'll be waiting right here, then. Rad. This way, then. <laughs> hmm. What's that green dot? Maybe that's a Higley, Higley stone. Ah, oh, sweet praise. Everything is low level. Should I attack and catch her? Oh. Sweet. <clears throat> <laughs> Weird. Paco. 
There you are. How'd you end up here, I wonder? Well, never mind that. Now let's get you back to Muriel. Oracle Borgle. Oh, Paco, there you are. King Evan, you found him. Thank you ever so much. Now we'll be able to come with you to Evermore. Wonderful. You'll both be very welcome. I'd be happy to take care of any monsters that give you that are giving you trouble. I'm a crack shot with the bow and arrow, you know. And it's the least I can do that after you went off, went and found my Paco for me. <laughs> that sounds good to me. Just promise me you'll teach him not to go wandering off by himself again. Yeah. Don't worry, I'm sure. I'll make sure he stays with me the whole time. Or go for a goal. Perfect. We'll look forward to seeing you there, Muriel. <laughs> Opaka is a knowledge for Opaka rearing that can boost the ranch's productivity. Well, good to know. Good to know. And there's a green dot. I'm gonna check it out. Is it a hickle stone? I feel like it is. Oh, I have to handle it? Fine. Alright. Oh! This is good. The Higgledy Playground Trip Door. Uh. Whoa! Higgle Piggle, you can't be serious. You can see me? Mr. Higglesworth. Wait a minute. Who is Mr. Higglesworth? Kitty 0706. You remember you guys remember Kitty 0706 0706, right? Elliot Elliot goes to school. That was, that was that was the best. You guys should check it out if you haven't seen it. It's it's funny. Mr. Higglesworth. <laughs> I'll let you all fail! <laughs> hig hig hig, how marvelous. You must have wonderfully pure hearts if you can see a higgledy like me. Non higgledy human folk. <sighs> oh. yeah. Come to the forest on occasion, but you are the first one to speak to me, Higgle, 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 Higgle. Right. Now, you may not be aware of this, but I have quite a penchant for collecting pebbles. <gasps> oh, I have pebbles for you. Hig, Hig, if you can give me ten of those sumptuous Tony delights, I will reward you with a piece of confectionery I came up with myself. Higgle, it's true. There you go. You handed over ten pebbles. Right. Pig, pig, pickle, this is wonderful. You did it, truly. You have earned your reward. Just make sure you don't break your teeth on it. Making my way downtown, walking fast, faces past, walking faster! Uh, I was talking about stuff that looks like proper. I was talking about that, that fur and the stuff that looks proper, wild, and edgy, but also kind of warm, you know? I guess. Oh, well done, Traveler. This is what I mean. This is the greatest thing that I've ever seen. Hey, we got a light, bro. It, the higgledy hidden inside the stone comes flying out. 
Twinkle the Twee has decided to join your adventure. Cool. I don't know what he does, so I guess... Let me take care of that. I, I kind of want to just put it... Just stick him in. Let's just, I don't know, get rid of one of these guys, like... I don't know. Is Cowardly good? I don't know. Let's, let's switch this guy out for Twinkle the Twee. Alright, let's head over back. Here, <coughs> I guess. Because I, I still like to be able to recruit one of the uh, those Greenling dudes. No? Alright, fine. Okay, let's head over back to. Ah! Gold pole. <laughs> Sorry, I was having a conniption for a moment. Alright. So there's one last individual who has a quest here. I don't know if it's actually a person now that you know, now that that's happened, you know. Or a person I can recruit rather. Hmm. Actually, there was a leaf book quote uh, post, wasn't there? A big higgledy hello, <laughs> Mr. Higglesworth. Higgled, higgled, higgledy he. A little boy with a pure heart actually managed to see me. It's amazing. It's the first time I've had any contact with human folk in years. I wonder how my mother is. Remember, person. Remember, people, pr everyone, if you see a person with a mental illness, encourage him. Always. Every time. It works, I swear. Oh, wait, you want to cure him of it? Oh, ho, ho. I thought you meant to solidify it more. How are you? Hello there, young man. I am pleased to say that this is your lucky day. Oh, no, I, I remember. You see, I've been looking for someone with whom I can share my tale. And what what a tale it is, an account of such bravery and daring do that it is sure to provide a source of strength and inspiration. It begins half a century ago when I was but a young pup trying to make my way in the world. Ha 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 ha. I just imagine the most sock puppet like imaginary thing that you can that you can think of. It's all like poorly done, poorly drawn. <clears throat> Best to make yourself comfortable, Evan. I feel like it's gonna be a long one. Mm -hmm. it, it does sound interesting, though. In fact, I'm rather looking forward to hearing it. Cor, you really have. You really are wide eyed innocent, aren't you? Right. And so I went to dazzle the world with my battlefield prowess. I traveled to distant kingdoms to smote entire herds of porks. I took the high seas with them. Ho oh, oh, ho oh. ho! High seas suppress schools of ferocious t fangfish. I once even brought down a wave, a wave worm with a single well placed arrow. I was unstoppable, invincible, the world's greatest warrior. Still imagine the sock puppet. <laughs> Gosh, that's, uh, well, incredible and. Is, is the only word. Arf, arf, you are impressed, I see, and no doubt you are wondering how you too might develop such a reputation. Well, yes, well, fear not, young man, I've prepared a trial for you. Oh, no. A trial? Indeed so. You are to turn to the shrine near the city and take on a fearsome monster by the name of Conflagra. <sighs> ominous smoke that surrounds her will make her easy enough to recognize. Almond smoke, that sounds familiar. It certainly does, man. I think you both know what we're dealing with by your... She's a vicious creature and no mistake. She she seems to enjoy nothing more than the sight of hapless travelers turning tail and fleeing in terror from her ferocious onslaughts. Which is not to say that I could not have triumphed over her in my younger days, of course. But age has taken its toll. My powers, I fear, are on the wane. I know I know better than to seek such confrontations now. Oh, oh but what? It's time for the younger generation to take over. You must smite the beast in my steed, stead. <laughs> and in doing so, you 
<laughs> You'll prove yourself worthy of being my success su successor. I far far. All right. Sorry, I was so distracted by the I far far that I forgot to say successor for a moment. All right, I'll do it. I'll go and defeat the monster for you. Right. Excellent. I knew you would not let me down. <laughs> what the heck was that? <coughs> Is that a bug? <laughs> Ugh. <laughs> Are you sure? Mm. Jeez. Are you sure about this, Mun? I mean, have you... Have you really thought it through? Properly, like? Mm. No. What is there... What did I think about Lofty? If this if this monster has been infected by an awful doctor, so what's got to deal with her? Ha! 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 Or we'll all be in trouble. And besides, I want to see if I'm as good as he was. <laughs> ha! I knew he'd really do in with all them tales of his... As, as your kingmaker, I'm obliged to say you're already twice the fighter he ever was. But there's only one way to find out for certain, ain't it? Oh. Level 33. Hey, Roland, what level are we at? Where, where are we at? 28. Maybe we can do it? No, but let's do it anyway. Let's just save and just, I don't know, just save, I guess. And how long has this episode been going on for? Eh, we can stick in one more battle, depending on distance. Hmm, I think we got it. Ah, c come on, jeez. Or a gold ball. <laughs> Hi, my name is, um, Porco the Alpaca, Orgle Borgle. Lucky for me, everything's all, like, proper and just staying away from me, so that's good. I just go up there. Sweet. I feel like I wasn't really meant to go up there, but I did it anyway. Excuse me. <sighs> this is not gonna turn out well. That's a level 35 manticore. Oh my gosh. Ah, uh, this is not gonna turn out well. I went around the wrong way. <laughs> <sighs> Ooh, what's this? This collapsed on, you know, on itself many years ago. You won't be able to go inside in its current state. Hello, miss. Was it gives off an unpleasant aura? Oh, it's 26? Okay. Uh, let's do this because I am beginning to realize that I should probably be utilizing this so much more. So it gives off an unpleasant aura. Yes, let's take it on. Sometimes rolling away in this is hard.
That was a lot easier than most things. Hmm. I doubt it really had anything to do with the tweaker, actually. It's just like, I mean, yes, it sped things up, but, but you saw how s slow its attacks were. It was like, it had like two attacks. It was dash and like, fireball, and I was like, huh. Okay. Weird. So anyway, that's taken care of. I still hate fairies, but I think I know why. It's because, like, it's because they're just, like, when they're just little and opportunistic like that, I just, I can't take them, because it's just like, because like when you're, like, trying to fight everything else that's all, like, trying to, like, you know, gnaw your face off, it's like, suddenly there's this little pipsqueak fairy that's all like, oh, I'm just gonna shoot <laughs> some fireballs at you. <laughs> Whoa. Uh, surely, surely not. Surely you not defeated the smoke shrouded fiend mm. we have indeed it wasn't easy but we managed it in the end <laughs> wonderful simply wonderful you're clearly you clearly boast the heart and soul of a true warrior <sighs> give, give, give me a second the indefatigable indefatigable <laughs> indefatigable spirit <laughs> That seeks her greater and greater challenges, mightier foes to smite, higher summons to scale. Yours is the truth path, the one true path. You were, you were. Forgive me, I cannot retain the charade any longer. Everything I told you has been a lie. As much as I enjoyed being looked upon with all and admiration, the truth is that that I deserve nothing of the sort. I am terrified of all forms of confrontation, and I have not a heroic bone in my body. I'm utterly worthless. Oh, well, I don't think that's exactly true. If you were really scared of confrontation, you would never have told told us about Conflagra and asked us to go and defeat her. Actually, no. Rather, it... If it was tr No, you're not doing it right, Evan. If you... More like I would have said, if you were truly scared of confrontation, you would have never have told me the truth. There we go. So now work on that. You're doing great. Excellent. And ask us to go and defeat her. Right. You are kind to draw the positives from my cowardice. Not, o not only are you a strong of body, but you are gentle of heart. To tell the truth, I have always thought of myself to be of little worth. This is no doubt why I turned to telling such tall tales. But you have shown me the error of such foolishness. You have a bright future ahead of you, I'm certain of it. You may even prove yourself to be a mightier warrior than the one I imagined myself to be. <laughs> Oh, I don't know about that. I have high hopes for you, young man. All I all I ask is that you return here and tell me of your adventures one day. Would you do that for me? Oh, oh of course. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. When I wish, then I wish you all the very best. Hmm. That wasn't really that hard. Interesting. Ah, oh, and time you leveled up. Oh, hello. So I guess that's it, huh? Let me stop by this guy really quick, just in case to see like if I can purchase more people. Welcome to Swift Solutions. Hello. Report completed tasks. We'll be done in a moment. I'm just doing this real quick. Okay, let's take on tasks. And let's take the rest of these. But I don't have anyone to introduce you at the moment. Ever so sorry. Oh, lovely. What what will you be doing? Let me just swap your tokens for. <laughs> we 
Wait, do I need frick prisms for something? What I like actually about this is that there's a good many things you can get, like... Remember that grass green thread? You can get it from this guy. Like, several other, like, things that you never really get, you can get it from this guy. It's actually really nice. Like, look, I can buy an alt... 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 purse. <laughs> that was harder than it needed to be. Like... Yeah, there. Back. Oh, by the way... Remember, as long as there are people, there will always be tasks that need doing. Now go forth, young friend, and I'll look forward to seeing you soon. So anyway, then let's set it, let's save it for the next episode of leveling up everything. <sighs> Borgo, Borgo.